Does Islam allow women to work? Yes, it does. Really? So Muslim women are not degraded and oppressed as many think? No, not at all. The birth of Islam brought with it a smile upon women's rights. In the Quran and Hadith, all Muslims, regardless of their gender, are asked to do their best and strive towards perfection at anything they do and at work. In Islam, there have always been prominent women assuming positions of influence and within the working environments. Examples include scholars, politicians and even warriors. Prophet Muhammad himself did not ask his wife Khadija to stop her trade and work. She was a high-profile successful businesswoman. She even recruited the Prophet himself to handle her trade and money before the revelation. A woman in Islam is not obliged to spend her earnings in the household. She can rather keep it to herself and spend it as she pleases, unless of course she chooses to contribute, in which case this should be greatly appreciated. Women who choose to work should ensure that the job doesn't hinder their responsibilities as a mother and wife. It should suit the woman's physical and psychological ability. It must be permissible in Sharia and it must be safe for herself, her religion and her chastity. Current examples of successful Muslim women include 